Thank you so much for joining me, Game Edge. We're back in Stranded Deep in a beautiful morning it is. Yes, it is. It's time for us to get some more stuff going today so we can survive another day. Hopefully, we'll do fine. Uh, yeah, we got ourselves going some protein right over here. We also have some protein up there. He's just kind of baking himself in the sun. We got uh, Willie Wilson in here. Uh, we should probably call him Wilson. But let's let's change his name. Let's take the label maker here and uh, bam. Let's just change it to Wilson. So I feel like it's really Wilson, not Willie. I want Wilson. <laughs> okay, so that's good. We got ourselves some PV plants here. We got the plants together. Pretty much trying to keep everything somewhat organized. I labeled some of those sticks and stuff. Put some uh, building supplies on the left-hand side uh, to keep us going so we know exactly where everything is because it also gets really difficult to find. So, yeah, let's try and do that. And uh, we're going to double-check this area here. Sometimes you get lucky. And there's something in here. Maybe a chest. Nothing. Eh? This is just an empty one. All right. Well, it's an empty boat. We're going to have to go out and about and take care of that we're also gonna need to uh, drink some water actually and then head out to, and uh, try and look for some wrecks and stuff some more crates chop down some trees get ourselves going and starting on our base also visiting other islands there's so many things left to do here uh for us to get ourselves really up to par um all right let's see here yeah just one more sip well, one more sip i think this meat should do okay for the night there we go keeps me all nice and perky <laughs> i like that uh, all right, we still have some crabs out there and other things, which is right over here, which will end up being a little bit of supper. Nothing wrong with that. It's just surprise the shite out of them. Surprise attack. Are you sleeping? Warming yourself in the sun? What are you doing? Getting a suntan? You don't get no suntans, dude. All right, that was an easy one. That was nice. For once, we, we got a surprise attack on the sun. Now, we got a big, big boar back there, and that means we're going to start getting some leather, and I'm going to need leather very shortly. i start putting some of my food, actually, just in here with this dude. All right. <laughs> okay, so I've got my refined axe and my knife. Well, not refined, actually, crude axe, I should say. We're going to need to uh, keep yourself alive as much as we possibly can. Look at those things sometimes on the ground. We can find some pee, -pee plants and stuff. Uh, but yeah, we're going to need to keep ourselves alive. Keep yourself alive. All right, um, anything else around here? No. Nothing here. Sometimes you find them right in those little bunches here all on the ground. So this should be okay. We're going to take care of that board too. Clear up our island so we have no problems. Of, uh, any kind of attacks and stuff. We have tons of sticks and stuff that we still, again, yet, which is fantastic. We'll come back and get those afterwards. I just really want to clear up the island from all these vicious little sons of beeswax. Uh, we take care of both snakes already, which is great. We needed to do that. But this is something you do early in the morning. You try and get yourself done. Oh, there is a vicious one. He's coming. Oh, crap. Oh, you didn't like that? I didn't like it either. I'm coming after you. Gotta watch out for my stamina. I'm not sure how many hits I'm gonna take with a crude. Oh, I missed. Darn you. Gotcha. Now oh. oh. yeah, you can say no all you want. That that was good, dude. I got you. Ooh. All right, uh, how badly hurt am I? Let's see, you guys should double check that. Actually, not so bad. <laughs> your box worth your bite, dude. All right, yeah, I know he's using his tusks and hitting us with it, but just join All right, we're good there. We're good in this area here, too. I think I picked up all I can. Uh, I think those PB plant in that one beforehand. Always looking around those rocks and stuff. They, they pretty much spawn in anywhere they want to. It's all random. You're going to enjoy the crap out. Oh, wow. Wow. That's really not an angle I was looking to get into. I right, put you here. This stuff just grow back two seconds ago because I'm sure you went through the here. I'm sure of it. I don't know. I guess we didn't. I guess we didn't. All right. Grab a little more. Go put that guy down. We're going to go for some ships. Looks like it's going to rain today. That's fantastic. Probably get yourself a second water going. Be nice right now at this point. Way things are going, we want to get caught with that. Anything else around here? Nothing that I can see. Nothing there. Okay, got some giant, giant food coming up. And again, again, it's giving us tons of rawhide, which is going to be able to turn into leather. So it's phenomenal. Put everything close together, and uh, you know what? I'll drop off a load here. Uh, make sure we're all good to go. And same thing, check our water supply. Just make sure this is full. This will fill itself up. Nice. Drop down all these again. I'm gonna build my cords and a whole bunch of goodies with that. Very, very important. Sticks there on the ground. And I think we're okay with the spear now. Uh, oh, I'm still not 100% sure. Oh, PB. 
right in front of us. Right in front of us. Okay. I think we looked at most of this island. I think it's time for us to go into the water, which is not good fun at all. Not in a storm. Guarantee you that. Oh, some sticks right here. And some corrugated scrap here. Some little scrap. Get a little driftwood action going. Get a whole lot easier with a refined axe. Once we wear this thing down, this axe, we're going to hold off, uh, not to let it go to zero. We're going to want to make this a refined axe. And that means I'm going to have to build up what I need to do now, which is uh, going to be the tanning rack so we can get ourselves and make some leather. Oh, look at that one. Sneaky, sneaky. That one's very sneaky. You guys know what I'm talking about right there. Look, starfish killer right there in between those rocks. That could have been just instantaneous death. <laughs> well, poisoning at least. <laughs> Not death. We have to say, don't feel like I have to go through. Okay, that stick went way out there. Way further than it should have. I have no idea where the hell it went, actually. It looked like it bounced out this way. I'll probably find it next time we go around the island. Um, I don't know where it went. I saw it fly, but it could have gone a lot further than it looked like. Okay, well, we got some pretty good stuff here. We got a couple of saplings. While we're here. Grab these and we'll drop them off and then we'll go for a swim. It might be a little nasty, but it's not nasty inside of the water. It's just a matter of trying to find where the heck the ship pieces are. Uh, usually it bubbles up and tells us where the ship is, so you know, it makes it a little bit easier. I need more chests. That is for sure. Okay, just keep them all together so it's all nice and neat. We don't have any kind of worries. And uh, yeah, okay, are we doing okay with this? Shouldn't be using any of those because of the rain. And we got corrugated. Alright, so PP and corrugated. That, that pig is really unhappy about us. Shaking his head like a non-stop. Alright, we're going to grab this knife. We're going to drop it off next to the fire. And we're going to head out into the water. Now, I think I can see a little bit of a ship right there. Yeah, right there. Right at the tip. We'll go back and when we come back, we'll pick up all the loot that's on here. There's some stuff right there and a rock right together. Very nice. I don't know how I missed that, but I did it. All right, so I sorted all that out. We're going to jump in. There it is. To water. Take a slow swim so we can regen. Lots of big, big fishies. You groping little fish. Oh, watch out. Okay, let's get some air. I don't think I got enough there. Let's get some air. Oh, leather. That's... Whoa, damn. All right. Well, that's what we're looking for today to do. And that turns out pretty darn good that it showed up. That's very nice. Um, that was a real shark, right? Oh, yeah. It was real. It's real. It's real. Real, 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 real. Holy moly, moly, moly. I don't see a crate on here. Let's get some air. Anything inside? I don't see anything inside of it. And nothing on top, right? I didn't get this concentrator or anything. It looks like it's gone. It's gone, gone, gone. All right, we can get those buoy balls and uh, maybe just get ourselves going with those. Maybe put on beach. Who knows? We might end up using them. He has a tiger. I think that's the tiger shark right there and a poisonous little fishy. Okay, it's not for your balls to play, buddy. It's my balls. Oh my god, the swells are so huge! Okay, get going, get going. A little too close for comfort. A little too close for comfort. Oh! Okay. Grab all that stuff we can. Alright, so that was pretty good. The storm has ended, actually. That's going to turn out pretty darn nice. I, I have uh, done what I had to do here in the bottom. Let's take a little sip here. Keep yourself going. We're going to look for the ships now. I do have, again, a spear in case. It really would take quite a bit to take down a shark with that. We're going to need to get some refined spears. Again, leather, 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 leather. Extremely important. Oh, look at this. I didn't see you guys. It's a bright, beautiful day, finally. Oh, another stick. So easy to miss, especially when it goes great out there, when it gets, like, storm size. Uh, yeah, I can't see shite at all. I really can't. All right, let's put away this. Let's 
go and find ourselves another wreck we can jump into. There's some bubbling there on the left-hand side. Let's we'll jump into the water and get that. Am I exhausted again? Oh my god, dude, I forgot how hard it is when you first start. Now, there is certain stats and stuff you can look at right here in the bottom. So we need our physicality back up. We need our cooking or hunting on top, of course. Our re uh, well, our resource manager, our harvesting there in the middle. And yeah, we need to get our strength up. We're only at two. Uh, so yeah, we're going to get some physicality. Let's get physical and get this done as fast as we possibly can. All right, got to be careful for any kind of crazy fish. I'm hoping to find Chester at something. I have not been very lucky. I'll be honest with you. Sometimes I think they're stuck inside there. There's some... Oh, shit. You guys saw that? I got a shark in my butt. Oh, my God. <laughs> that was close. Okay, he's either following me, but it looks like a different kind of shark, too. Uh, we will have to go hunting for these dudes and uh, take them out because they're, they're definitely becoming a problem. I'm looking for more bubbling on the water. The water bubbles will tell you where the wrecks are, so... Yeah, you just gotta keep your eyes out on that. And hopefully we can find at least another one or two of these. And I'm not gonna say no. Every little ounce of this counts. We need those. You see them bubbling anywhere? I do not see bubbling. There's not many wrecks in this one. It might be a little further out or on the side, I don't know, but I'm not seeing this is, oh, I'm seeing Zilch here. So not the best island for wrecks, that is for sure, but it definitely is big enough to start building up over here. Look at that. That's a good little stretch of land. We don't need a big place. Oh, right in front of us. I see it. I see what I want to go and get. It's a little further out. We can do it. Be positive. Before the end of the day, hopefully. Without dying. Okay, let's do this. Oh, that's what people are saying with kindling. It's a couple of you were mentioned that. My kindling had flipped over when I flipped over my raft. So there you go. Double shot. We're lucky enough we found when we didn't have to make it. Oh, man. It gets so drained. I forget how fast he drains is there another storm no oh stay away from that those things are vicious man let's get this over here where is it there it is another one that's completely all the treasures are not here there's like no treasures in this island it sucks Oh, there's some clay right there, though. That's good to know. Once we get the pickaxe, we can come back and get some clay right out there. Really nice little find. Double shot of clay. Okay. Well, it went out of treasure, but it had clay. And that's the important part we need to find anyways. And that'll be helpful because we're going to need a couple stations with that to keep ourselves going. And I believe we got that one right there. So we did pretty good. Is that another one over there? Just going to have to double check it. There is some bubbling, I think, right there. I don't know. It may be just white caps. Yeah, I think it's just white caps. All right, well, so be it. Not the best island for this, but it has a whole bunch of other goodness. So uh, let's start building up our racks and stuff that we need to get done. This guy keeps on nodding his head like as if it's bad. We also need a smoker. So let's get. Let's actually look at that because I need to smoke this meat. I can't waste it. It's going to be comparative for us to survive. So we're going to need a smoker right here. And we're going to need, of course, the ring. We have that already. We have the fire in the ring. We need three sticks and one lash. All right, we got this. One lashing, three sticks, one, two, three, and uh, yeah, one cloth. Now, I did mark one of these as cloth. Yeah, right there on the bottom. Beauty. Okay, so we got one cloth and stuff like that. Beauty. I'm going to place this down right here and rotate it until we get to where we want in front of us. It's pretty close to our tent, but no worries. We don't actually sleep in it, so yeah, it works out okay. It's open, right? Yeah, it's the open part. Sweet. All right, so now we can carve up and place on all the stuff we want to on there. And that is going to be imperative. So let's take up a refined knife. And start slicing and dicing. Blah. Blah. Well, you're going to have to deal with it, dude. I really, really want to do another crate with uh, for food. Uh, it looks like I'm going to have to uh, make do and maybe use a raft. A storage. That would be disgusting, right? Ooh. Now, look at that. Look the amount we got there. Now we're going for the meat. Now we're going for the chunks. Decent sized meat. Medium size, I think. Another medium sized meat. Very cool. He's gone. And you know what? I'll just start carving up some of these guys. Oh, it's disgusting. Oh, I know it's freaking gross, dude. I get it. 
if I need to like refine spears and stuff. Wow, those shadows are flickering like crazy. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, Tony. I, I need your skin. We, we need to get some work done. Give me your itsy bitsy meat now. That sounds bad. Oh, there we go. He's giving me two pieces. That's not bad, actually. A chunky one. Wow. All right, so yeah, we got a couple of big pieces of meat from the big boar and a couple of other ones, so that's good. Uh, we'll start placing down. We'll grab the meat like this. We can put five pieces of meat in here, no matter what size. Just look down near the wood here. It makes it easier to place. Okay. And we'll put that one for food right away. Start by fire. Sweet. Whew. Okay. We're good. I think that's pretty good. It's going to be at least cooking this up. Just going to take some time. We'll have to launch a fire the ring right there. Uh, maybe add one more piece there. I think that's almost done. There we go. Nice and full. Could have waited a little bit longer, but it's good. Now we got at least our meat cooking. And next station we're going to need to make is the other station. We're also going to need to make a loom too. That's going to be extremely important for us again. It's going to take four uh, lashings. That's why we got so much of the uh, cord and stuff. We're going to need those. And there's tons of sticks needed for that. But we need this tanning rack. So tanning rack is next. And I'm going to need myself four of those. So let's do this. Two, three, and four of those. Sweet. And I don't know we're going to put the tanning rack, I think, because it's too bad we can't just pick up and move afterwards the stuff we have put down. But it's just is like temporary. Anyways, it's meant for us to kind of like chillax on and uh, get ourselves going so we can kill these giants. Uh, there it is. There's a tanning rack. We can make that happen. I want that a little straighter than that, though. Maybe right here. Oh, you know what? Right between. That looks cool. Yeah, it looks cool. All right, so a tanning rack, pretty darn simple. As long as you have this rawhide on you, you press down on C and hold down on it. And you can go make yourself a whole bunch of them. It doesn't take any time. There's no timer on it, which is you know kind of odd, I guess, in some cases. You expect it to take some time for tanning, for drying and stuff, like it does on this and other ones, but it does not take time. <laughs> I just took the uh, lamp and put it up here. Look how it turns out. A nice little lighting for this guy. <laughs> awesome okay uh so yeah we got tanning rack and stuff now we gotta start making ourselves other things uh the important part right now like i mentioned holy croup uh is for us to uh make sure that we have this used up a little bit so we're gonna go and chop down a little bit of wood and get that going we can put down our knife right here and what we want to make is a refined axe but we don't want to waste like i mentioned anything at all we could make the spears though let's check out the spears refined spears yeah we need sticks and more rocks so probably getting this is important too. Our refined pickaxe, because there's some, if I'm not mistaken, there's a rock pile up here somewhere. Is there still a rock pile? I think it's right here, right? Yeah, there's one rock pile there. There might be a second one around here that we can utilize. We got two rocks uh, piles, and that's pretty good. It's going to keep us going. Because I don't want to use it just for pickaxe and then not use it all. Uh, yeah, I don't think there's two of them. But we can always hit out other islands and come back with a good loot that we can get. But yeah, it doesn't look like there's more in that. It does take up quite a bit of rocks. I know. But um, it is what it is. We have lots anyway, so it's okay. We'll, we'll just deal with it. Let's put this down over there for now. Lift you up so it brightens up the whole area. Okay, let's make a couple of these. Two of those. And we have the rest of the stuff, including the wood, is right next to us, as you can see. On top left. Boom. Pickaxe. So it's great. Now we can utilize our pickaxe and bring that over here. And uh, hit up this rock right there. Which will give us exactly what we need, I think. For survival, we'll also be able to get clay and start other stations up. I'm definitely going to need to get these spears upgraded to refined spears. We have not found any refined spears. And uh, I don't think you find it very often in these islands. It's usually just crude. There we go. But this isn't only for the rocks, it was for clay. I just want to make sure I can you know, get my resources back before I do anything else. Just very, very, very important. Right, let's put the lantern back here. And I guess I'll put the tools all together right here. It's going to be important so we don't lose any of them. PP together. Thank you. And knife together. There we go. As long as I can see them all, we're all good to go. All right. So that's good. Let's get the uh, refined spears going too. And that is going to be down here. Refined spear. 
And again, we need those spears we have already. So phenomenal. Some of these are already used a bit. It's all good. So we need about four of them. Two, three, four. Okay, I'm just going to drop these here. Can I do a five, fifth one on it? Oh, nice stacking. Okay, good. So we got that. That is very, very nice. Now we can make ourselves the refined spears. Productive day, I tell you, dude. That, that is pretty darn productive. All right, we got the refined spears. Now we can take on a shark, most likely, if everything goes well. We could probably could use a couple more of these, though. I'm thinking maybe a few more. We have a couple of leather left. From, no more on me. Okay, we have a couple here left, which we found. So we can do two more of those. Uh, but I'm still going to need to refine. Hmm. The refine act. I'm worried about using that. You know what? I'm going to hold off a little bit. I'm going to stick with four of these. Try and do our best. Maybe make a... You know what? I'll make a couple crappy ones. There we go. Crafts and shit's going up. We're fantastic. We'll get four more of those done. All right. So we have... Oh, we did five. Oops. So we have four and four. At least... Oops. It was four. Oh, that was one in my hand. There we go. Uh, well, yeah, we'll make four and four of these. That way we can at least have those on our inventory. We can utilize them. At the same time, we're going to have to go and get some sticks and stuff and get some sleep. All right, how's my fire going? Okay, cooked. Keep your stats up. Very cool. All right, that's all full. We can put down some more of you. I think I need two, right? I think it's two. Oh, just one. All right. Oh! Cooking's done. Smoked, cooked. Oh, these are all just cooked. These are all smoked, though, of course. The larger ones are still need to be smoked. It takes a lot longer. So we'll keep that going a tiny bit. Plop that. Look at the refined spear. All right. I'll wait this out a tiny bit, and uh, we'll probably actually, you know what? Since we have to wait, let's utilize our time properly here because I want to get this done. Can you get up? Oh, there's another one over here. Dude, there's more rocks. Sorry for the darkness. I knew that I thought. You know, I was in my head going, I think I did saw it. Yep. I did. Now, shove them on a beach like this. You won't lose them. It's the easiest way. I recommend it to you guys to shove them. Right there. Since we're not going to use them and make ourselves some space, we're going to need that ASAP. So let's go towards our light so we don't forget where it's at. Get rid of this big node. Come on, baby. Let's hit this rock. We can do it. Grab just a couple more of these. If we can. This way we can make, again, more spears and utilize it. Now, we're just going to need to get some more leather. And leather is going to be definitely, unless we get lucky, uh, go back to our other island and go back and pick up the stuff. But we'll go we'll to a new island, that's for sure. We're definitely going to have to go to a new island. I don't think that's going to be worthwhile. The other island was pretty shitty. I'm thinking about it now. Didn't have very much stuff on it. Okay. Grab it with right click. Utilize our time as much as we possibly can. Now, these things should be growing back today. These yucca fruits. Uh, well, these yucca. The fruit is this part here. You can plant it. Uh, I don't have time right now to start making planters and stuff. I also don't have uh, the ceramic to, of course, make everything I need. To start filling up that. We barely have enough. We can make coconut bidens and stuff, but right now I don't think I feel like spending all that time doing that. Get rid of this pine. Stop hiding our good yucca. And then we're going to refine axe the crap out of this. So this is extremely important. Oh, I think I found a stick that flew away last time. Yeah, there's another pine right here. There's another stick right there. At this beachfront, what's this? Potatoes? Oh, very nice find. Very nice. I'm appreciating it. Oh man, that's good. One and two. Come on, baby. You hear that? I thought I heard someone walking. Oh, nice. Harvesting up. Being pretty good, actually. And the axe is 48, so that is okay. Is there any other kind of uh, plants here on the bottom? Nothing. Nothing around here? No. Let's 
we can go around this way here and find if we can find some more of that goodness around here. Is that the other potato? No. It sometimes it just looks like it. It's tough to find, I'm telling you now. Easy to make a mistake and think it is, but it isn't. We have to go back and like, check three times just to make sure. Now our food should be ready to go, I believe. We're going to go grab the last bit here and fill up our, of course, our inventory as much as we possibly can. And we'll get back to our base. Maybe chop down one big palm tree, too. And get those going from the other side. All right, we're full. We're full. Go figure. There's some more, bra of course, sticks on the ground and all stuff. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. All right, drop you off here. Does that work as well? Yeah, so right click works on them, too. Okay. And yeah, we have tons and tons of sticks here. We also have these things full, by the way, if you guys wonder. They're all full. <laughs> it's all in good shape. We'll drop these off here. I hope that didn't fling. It looked like it flung off of me, but I think it's just a graphic. There we go. Yeah, they're starting to fill up a little bit too much for us to place down here. Got a lot of sticks, dudes and dudes. That is good news. Keep that going. I'm liking that. And we'll put down our axe over here. We also have those fine potatoes. I'll be grateful later on. We're not going to use them right now, but I do want to keep all this stuff together. Do I have another potato here somewhere? I'm so sure I found another potato. Not positive. Oh, I forgot about you guys. You can fill up a lot of stuff, too. Yes, you can. You can fill up the fire if you want to with this. Boom, like that. Perfect. How are we doing? Smoke, 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 smoke. Good. All right, we have no storage unit, so this will be our storage unit for now. Let's get some sleep and see what it looks like in the morning. I think we're pretty good everywhere here. Yeah. All right. Early morning. Look at what we did. That looks really cool, doesn't it? I love the look of this thing. By the way, the tanning rack, it looks great. Also, if you have the uh, label maker, I know I mentioned this many times, but these are brand new. Just press spacebar, get rid of stuff you don't want to be seen. If you're tired of names popping up for no apparent reason, you don't need to know what it is. <laughs> you can get rid of it. And yeah, this it makes it a lot better, I think, overall. I, I don't like seeing any of the names pop up. And more realistic. You can turn it off in the options, too. That is your choice. Uh, personally, I'm, I'm just, uh, you know, I'll let it go. I, I just kind of... Uh, I, I kind of like the rest of it. I need the names pop up with some stuff. And so I'm fine with it. It's your choice. Dealer's choice it is in the options. But we're in good shape. Let's drink up a little bit of water. Good. We will have a little snack. Nice little breakfast sausage. I hope that wasn't a sausage. <laughs> All right. So tomorrow morning, I think we're going to have to start looking at... Uh, oh, my God. I think we're going to have to head back to the other island and uh, pick up the stuff to make a raft. Or we can start making... Because we get the buoy balls, we can make a crappy little raft. I think we're going to have to make a crappy little raft and get ourselves around a tiny bit. And uh, going from island to island, bring back some resources from here. All right, we're going to leave the episode here. We did pretty good. We got everything. So thank you so much for being here. You guys are absolutely the best. This game edge, it'll catch you guys on the flip side. Mm -hmm.